Here we are in Mobile, sitting on the beach here. We found a nice little spot with a little side entrance over here. It doesn't seem to be an issue us coming down here, but I'm pretty flippin' excited, guys. I've got a review, full disclosure. I was sent this for free to review, but I'm just so excited to have it here because we're gonna be in the Philippines for a month and then back in Indonesia on plenty of beaches. But I got a snorkel here to review. It's called Amio Power Breather. It's by a German company, and a gentleman named Jan, is one of the owners, sent it to me here, and uh, let's check it out. So it comes in this nice travel kit, which make, keeps it super organized in your bag. This is my first time getting it out on the trip, and uh, it's just been sitting nicely in the bottom of my bag so far. So I just grabbed it before we left, and let's get it opened up here. Flip it open. Comes with some instructions here. Uh, it came with the snorkel mask, which is super nice. I didn't think it was gonna have this when I opened it up. So that was a nice, pleasant surprise. Then we got the snorkel here, which is like super futuristic looking. I love the design of this because I love sci-fi and it just looks badass. And then we got a couple different length uh, piece attachments for the top here. So one set is a little shorter than the other and that is for when it's a little wavier out. You can put the longer attachment pieces on. And then you also have the wave cap pieces here as well which help keep water from entering the top. So you can just slide it right in there on the top there. I don't see any reason not to use those all the time. But a uh, super cool thing about the snorkel here. Ooh, sun's coming out. So the cool, really, really badass feature of this that I really enjoy. Um, first off, when you put it on, you want to angle the mouthpiece out on the bottom here. Get to about close to a 90 degree angle, and then you just stick it in your mouth, loosen the top part up so it fits around your head. And then you just put your mouth in like this. Right above the ears. <laughs> so you just twist the top piece and it tightens right onto your head there, which is really, really cool. But my favorite feature about this is that there's little exit holes for the water that comes in the top on the bottom. And since the mouthpiece is above those holes, realistically you should never get water in your mouth because it comes straight down the holes here and comes straight out the bottom and the air stays on the top. So. That is definitely my favorite feature about this. But let's put the whole thing together here quick. So, you wanna put the mask on first. Uh, if you don't, it'll be really tough to get the snorkel on. So, first just pop the mask on. That sun is hot, by the way. I'm glad I put sunscreen on. Really nice, comfortable fit. And uh, great thing about the snorkel mask, if you've ever been diving before, uh, scuba diving or free diving at all, you need to equalize. So you can pinch your nose and equalize. Side tip, if that doesn't work for you, for me, I just need to swallow and my ears equalize amazingly. The nose thing doesn't work for me. But then after you have the goggles on, you go ahead and put this in your mouth again. Easy peasy, it is hot here, so this is fogging up a little bit just from the humidity coming off from my, or the moisture coming off my body here. But uh, let's get this fully set up and go give it a test. Have you ever tried this product out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's from a German company, Amio Power Breather. Yeah. How much? 
much. About 120 US dollars. 500 US. No, 120. 100. Yeah. Yeah. You know what? I'm going to tell you now if you go to the website and use the code PIKEYS, I'll get a little kickback. Always plug. This and the goggles come together. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, 120. Yeah. This is good. Very cool. I'm about to try it for the first time, so, yep. Let you know. Yeah, we'll let you know. <laughs> guys I don't know if you can tell but it's actually a different day I can't remember if I'm wearing the same shirt or not but that's the way it goes in Southeast Asia so as far as the snorkel goes the snorkel goes I'll start off with the pros first it feels really nice once you put the snorkel on it's in place it stays really really secure and in place but that can also work as a con because if you're not a more experienced snorkeler and you might have little moments of panic where you want to take a full mouth of air without the snorkel in place, it's kind of hard because you can't really pull it away. So I would say that the snorkel is probably more for intermediate to advanced snorkelers. If you're more of a beginner snorkeler, you might want to get one that you can easily spit out and free your mouth. But like I said, the design is super cool. I love that the water comes out, so you get little salt water in your mouth. If you're a novice like me, you're probably still gonna get a couple mouthfuls because uh, you might tilt your head back too far and get the uh, air ports into the water still. But that's just a total novice move that has nothing to do with the snorkel itself. A pro and con, it's more of a solo or a snorkeler because if you wanna talk to the people around you, once it's in place, you're not gonna be able to talk that much. Overall, I'd say it's an excellent product. I'm going to enjoy using this product for the next two months looking for as many sea turtles as I can. 